here we go, a road trip to Universal Studios, California, with the A-Team, right? Yeah. <laughs> Scorpion Seconds. There's the four of us, but then we also have Chucky. He'll be taking a little trip with us too. Oh, what is it? What's the flavor? Does it taste good or what? Coronavirus! Coronavirus! Are you saying virus? He's saying coronavirus. Nothing like a little strangulation to get the circulation going, I say. Coronavirus! He's like a puppet. Oh, you're gonna get it now. Jim, 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 Jim. It does. It could probably puncture the skin very well. So be quiet. Stop, stop. Oh, hush, you little child. This time. You one. <laughs> oh, it got on my hand. <laughs> you know what? At this point, <laughs> ew, you did it over the pillows.
in this place called Waterworld. Praise God. What's the second? What was your second favorite? Come on, Asher. Mario Kite. The Mario? Bowser's Challenge. Number one, Harry Potter soaring over the sky. Number two, Jurassic Park. The Fast and Furious part of the studio tours was pretty cool, too. Yeah, that was the Less motion third sickness thing. to that one. Oh, well, that was Asher's third place. Yeah. Also, the Simpsons one. Oh, the Simpsons one. That's four. Asher. I love story two. They're Time. both really like which was your least favorite, Asher? Studio tour of the Donkey Kong. No, King, Kong. King, Kong. King Kong. King Kong. There you go, the King Kong part. He was pretty scared of that. Uh, my, <laughs> my top two or three rides, Harry Potter one. What was it called? I don't know, Forbidden something. Uh, I think my second favorite was probably the Universal tour. I kind of liked that one. And I also liked the King Kong interaction part with the Fast and Furious thing. Ah! Definitely an upgrade from last time. I actually didn't like that, apparently. But Maybe. third would Maybe probably be the Jurassic World ride because when I was there years back, probably a decade ago, it made a, it made a lot of improvements on that ride. So I like that. I think we can all agree the one we liked the least Mark was one. the uh, Pet, Secret Life of Pets. Uh, we all don't have the demographic here, but we're an 8-year-old and 11-year-old. Um, we felt like that was kind of definitely a little bit more low-key. It was... Not interactive much, but it was if you like yeah, just kind of like things yeah, hanging around and he, going. Dick, 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 dick. Liked it. That's kind of like yeah, that's all it is. Is the animatronics? They're creepy. Oh, yeah, he thought okay. they were creepy. Yeah, they were. They looked like they were staring at ah, I like them. So some of yeah, the animatronics. Especially Ooh. when, especially when both of the dogs get stuck in the match like, <laughs> like <laughs> yeah, like dog was actually acting like he was dead like this. Jeez. All right. And we didn't do a couple rides because again. Oh yeah, we did not get to do the mummy or the Transformers ride, so that'll be next time's agenda. Transformers, not for me. I mean, that'll be great. Next time you have to try Transformers because you don't know until you do it. No. The other one I like. Well, you don't that know because you never tried it. Waterworld is always one of my favorites as a show-wise. I like the Waterworld because of the stunts and the action. And that's our trip to Universal. We got cotton candy and a giant donut. And be prepared to spend about $1,000 on everything else other than your tickets for the parking and food and all that stuff and gifts. All right, see you later. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.